Hey there riders, Moto Jenna Chris here this morning and I thought I'd have a really quick chat about two really, really good mods for new riders and I'd probably recommend these as the number two modifications to make to your bike or accessories to add because they do very different things but they're going to help 99% of you out um, in both direct and indirect ways. It's really, really easy when you first get a bike to, you know, pick up those awesome adjustable coloured levers and um, put a bit of bling on your bike, believe me I've done it. Uh, but there's also some mods which are really worthwhile adding straight up or as soon as possible that will both protect your machine and also make life a little bit easier as a motorcyclist. So let's have a look at one of those first up. Now they never come up all that well on the camera unfortunately, however these things here these are Oggy Knobs. Uh, I'm in Australia and I highly recommend Oggy Knobs because they are made in Australia. They're an Australian company, all that kind of thing. They're a really, really good addition to every motorcycle. Now, these are also the same thing as crash posts. And you can get these in a variety of different designs. Different companies make them and do them. And what they do is if your bike goes down, they reduce the amount of fairing damage you take. Uh, they're a good investment even though they're a couple of hundred bucks because what they essentially do is they'll protect all of these fairings here and a lot of accidents. You'll just take a little bit of RN damage and maybe a little bit of exhaust damage as well, which on a stock exhaust doesn't matter so much. So like I said, most of the time these are really, really easy to install. All you need to do is bolt them on. You might need to take the fairings off. Most of them are no cut kits, so that, like I said, they just bolt on, there's no actual modification of your fairings or anything like that. And because most beginner motorcyclists do drop their bike, this is a good way of ensuring that it's not the end of the world. You're not paying hundreds and hundreds of dollars for fairings. All you might need to do, I mean, I wouldn't normally replace these if, even if they're damaged, um, but you might need a new bar end, you might have scratched your mirror a little bit. They just reduce the overall damage. Uh, particularly even if you lay the, lay the bike down at low speeds, so if you crash at low speeds, they can help quite a lot. Uh, people do mention that they can catch on the road um, and cause frame damage, uh, but at the end of the day, the reality is if you're in a serious enough accident for that happen, normally your bike was gonna be ridden off anyway, and uh, I think it's better to have these for all of those more common accident types, like just dropping the bike in a car park as a new rider. Uh, the second and not quite as integral modification to me is something else on this particular bike and it's having some luggage installed. I've got the Ventura pack on the back. As you can see here it's a really simple install. So all this one installs onto is the pillion foot peg mounts and also onto the rear fender mounting points. And just with those simple mounting points you get all these different bag options and they mean that no matter where you're riding or when you're riding you'll always be able to put heaps of stuff on the back of the bike and you're not riding with a backpack. The uh, backpacks are necessary evil at times however if you're doing longer kilometers or you've got heavy stuff you really want them on something like that because at the end of the day it'll mean you're less tired when you're riding, uh, you're more comfortable and you can concentrate on the riding itself instead of having to worry about the things strapped to your back. Uh, so like I said, two really, really great mods for new riders. Uh, Oggy knobs here, or obviously you can also get crash knobs or any other brand. I do recommend the Oggy knobs because I've used them on a number of machines. They've done a really good job. And some luggage, which in this case, again, I recommend the Ventura. Really, really good luggage, good value very easy to fit and also the best part is see these L brackets on the bike here which is that long bar along the tail uh, that's specific to each bike but the actual bag and the rack is universal so you can buy it for one bike and if you switch bikes you just buy a new set of L brackets bolt them on and you're ready to go with your old bag really really good value in that regard anyway hopefully this will have helped new riders pick out a couple of easy modifications to add to their bike which will really help them out in the long run this is moto journal chris hit that subscription button don't forget to hit the notification bell as well leave a comment or a like and let me know what you think